So the go-go of the College Park Skyhawks as we tip off what is the tip-off tournament. Of course, the first part of the season. Top returner, just over 17 points a ball game last year with College Park. Triple from the corner is Justin Champetti. It gets the go-go on the board, three zip. Really, the group that went into training camp is the same group we're seeing here tonight in opening night. Which is unusual in the G League. Ball away three from the corner, but a follow slam. Driven home by Daquan Plowden. Good job by Taylor Funk to go and find there was a switch, and he found his guy to not give up an easy basket. Champetti flies in for the deuce. Yeah, Champetti come out with a really aggressive approach at both ends of the floor. And now he has three or four for eight points, made a couple of threes, he's hit the glass. Here's Leaky Black. Gives it up to Taylor. Taylor Funk drives it rejected. Seven footer John Butler Jr. is to knock down that three, and that's a big part of his game. The outside shot, short jumper. Coach was calling, that's a turn. I said, you could call that turnover almost every possession. When your team hits a dry spell, you turn to them and say, go get us one. Boy, Moke made, made that difficult. Champetti was there for the block. And then the hoop on the other end and whistle it on a foul. Solid. I mean, he's played eight minutes and he has three made threes. Three for three. Actually, one was out of three, but he's got nine points. Well, he had the four points. Oh. He was the 13th overall pick in 2020 by the Pelicans, and he did spend three full seasons with the Pelicans. And then with got the Raptors, again. he got traded to... And here's Steven Sid. He had it ripped and no foul, no whistle. And all the way in for an easy bucket is Harris. I don't think Topper can believe that there was no call on that steal. After the same guy got called for something similar on the possession at the other end before it. Yeah, JBJ, John Butler Jr. knocks down the three. Rebound, Leaky Black up ahead. Foster Jr. to the rim. Flying in for the three, no good. And Mo Gay did a nice job of just tipping the ball to his teammate. Exactly, a volleyball tap, and he's rewarded for it. And they will get the ball back for one more possession at least. Oh, that is an answer. And I'm guaranteeing you that that was discussed. They must have seen that this is the kind of action you could get seeing when the Skyhawks did defensively. Deep triple is good. Things like killer instinct, right? That is, you either have it or you don't. And it's not about the physical attributes as much as what you can do. The go-go need a bucket. 63-61. Yeah, College Park back out in front. Foster hammers his way down. He's officially an assistant coach with the Wizards this year. He said he's going to be on the bench about 25 games this season. Splitting time. Nebhart drives it home. And it's a go-go lead at 65-63. You know what I love when he said, because there's some games that are in the day here with the go-go, and then the Wizards play at night, he said, so I'll do like JV and then varsity. Nemhart's going to finish there. Again, defense and the offense. Back-to-back -back buckets. Shot clock winding down. Got to get it off. And look at Fade away oh. three and then knock down triple. I thought that was a perfect example. JBJ can go out and guard guards because he's that quick. But it's not giving them the easy look. Here the go-go. Had some success getting to the rim but not finishing. To your point and finishing on the other side is Barlow. He brought it in. For the Skyhawks. This one, a fancy one. Two hand over two guys. And Mo Gay picked up the foul as four and spent the year with the Austin Spurs and the Texas Legends. 
three ball good. Jordan Bowden. Justin again, a hustle play, sees it coming off the rim and just goes after it. Nice. Three for Kyra Lewis Jr. Here's Harris, works the pick from Bradley. Kicks to the quarter, gets it back to Bradley. Wow. And an easy lay in and fostering was put on skates underneath. I feel like it has taken the go go a little longer to get into the offense. I mean, we're looking at four seconds on the shot clock with a contested three for Kyra. Yeah, it was a clean look for Lewis, but Brett Harris, D line him on the Mighty Metal Sports Network. Well, that's the 19th turnover and. Many of them have led to exactly that, a layup at the other end. Wow. Triple is good. <laughs> Big Coach Topper wanted to get a quick three. And yeah, then which I understand because you need, you need two possessions. And now it's a six-point game. Scoring attack for the Go-Go tonight. Yeah, I mean... You see 38 bench points. That's impressive. So a lot to work with for head coach Cody Topper. They'll go back to work. 